Yo, what is going on, everyone? Welcome back to the Zen Lounge. It is December 18th, 2023, and I have some exciting data to share with you guys today. A buddy in the comment section of my last video asked me to cover the Quorum Rich List. So today we are going to be covering the Quorum Rich List. And I believe when I share this information with you, it's going to make you extremely, extremely bullish and excited for the upcoming Pulsera airdrop. I don't think people realize how big this could possibly be for the holders of 10,000 Corium. Now, because this is a bullish update, I want to remind you a quick disclaimer. I'm not a financial advisor. You have to do your own research. You have to um, make your own decisions. I'm just sharing my journey with you too. So I just had a bullish Sologenic update this morning. Make sure to go watch my previous video. I have tons and tons of content. I've been filming content for Corium for over two years now. So let's get into the rich list. So as we know, the Pulsera is basically the all-in-one one-stop shop for Corium. They're going to have a DEX, automated market makers, all types of cool stuff. Uh, I was reading through the white paper today and I was getting really excited about what I was reading. So I'll put the white paper in the description below. Um, but there's going to be a lot of opportunity, not only this airdrop, an awesome airdrop, but this airdrop, you'll be able to earn yield with this airdrop. You could stake it, you provide liquidity with it. There's a lot of utility behind this token. So this is not going to be your average airdrop, in my personal opinion, based on reading this uh, reading this white paper. I think it's going to be a core essential piece to Corium becoming successful. So we all know that I did do a mistake on my previous video. So the grand total of tokens, the supply is um, 1 billion, 1 billion tokens, and 400 million will be airdropped to uh, uh, the Corium community. 380 million are going to be airdropped to the Wallace with 1500 Corium. So when the buddy left a comment saying, yo, Zen, cover the Corium rich list. By the way, I love when you guys suggest content for me to make because sometimes I'm trying to figure out what video should I make today for the Zen Lounge community. So when you leave suggestions, I'm going to act on it. So for future reference, let me know what you guys want me to cover. So I'm on this website. You can look for it yourself. I'll put it in the description below. But SmartStake uh, provides analytics for the Corium blockchain. And I discovered something that Corium, there's currently 1,552 wallets that have 10,000 Corium on the Corium ecosystem. So if you have 10,000, so that means right now, if this snapshot was taken today, so if they snapshot at the wallets today, Less than 1,552 wallets, because remember, exchanges don't count. The foundation don't count. So less than 1,550 wallets would be sharing the distribution of 380 million tokens. You do the math yourself. That is going to be a fat, juicy airdrop. Now, so uh, if you have if, if you have 10,000 quoriums on the main net, you are currently in the top 1500. Now, before I go into more numbers real quick, I did go ahead and look at the XRP ledger because Corium is unique that it's actually on two networks right now. We have the Corium on XRPL that if I was, if, if it was me, I would move Corium from XRP ledger to the main net as fast as possible to start getting APR from staking, maybe even put it a liquidity pool on osmosis and get ready for these juicy airdrops. So I'm going to the XRP rich list and about the exact same. So there's currently 1,595 wallets on the XRP ledger with 10,000 Corium. So let's say just everybody, all 1,500 wallets on XRPL ends up moving over. That would still be 3,000 wallets sharing 380 million, that's huge. However, I believe a lot of these people are not involved in crypto right now. The bear market was rough for them. They're not paying attention. A lot of these wallets on the XRPL, let's call them the stragglers. A lot of these stragglers are going to miss the boat and they're going to be so upset that they missed the boat. So don't be one of the stragglers. Watch my old videos. 
learn to use the Solidinic Bridge, bridge your XRPL tokens to the Quarium mainnet and start benefiting. Uh, start benefiting. So there's 1,500 wallets with 10K on XRPL, 1,500. So there's about 3,000 people that technically qualify, but the only people that have done the right step are um, 1,500 wallets on Quarium. I expect that to grow as we get closer to January 19th, the snapshot. But um, yeah, this is really, really bullish. So um, we're gonna get a lot of Sarah tokens, wallets with 10,000 Quarium. And uh, they made it very easy for people that were long-term. Remember a lot of people got all these tokens airdropped for free. So a lot of people have been with Solo, then they got, they got, they, they held Sologenic, they got Quarium free for an entire year. And then at the end of the year, their Quarium basically doubled with the Quarium for Quarium snapshot. So um, another huge update. So everybody's talking about Sarah. You know, everyone's really excited for Sarah. That's basic. Sarah is basically going to be my new girlfriend in 2024. So I'm pretty excited about that. But anyways, we have another airdrop that's planned. So this is airdrop number two. And rumor on the street is there could be three airdrops planned for the Quarium community. So how exciting is that? So the Catches Network, hopefully, hopefully I'm pronouncing that correctly, has a snapshot for, that's going to be taken next year on a very, very special day. Those that hold Quarium on mainnet will be included on the snapshot. More details on this will be revealed soon. So you probably want to follow this account and stay updated with this account. But people might be wondering, so how do I know if I'm on Quarium mainnet? Well, if your Quarium is in a Sologenic wallet or a Zum wallet, you're on the XRP ledger. You're not on the Quarium mainnet. You want to get either a Leap wallet. I think Leap wallet is one of the more favorite wallets nowadays. You get Kepler, which will take a little bit more user experience for Quarium at the moment. Or you could get um, Cosmos Station wallet, the IBC wallet. Uh, if I was a brand new person, I would probably get Leap Wallet. And you can just download that right on your phone for free. I do have videos teaching you how to stake Quarium with Ledger. I have basically all the videos you need also on my website as well. But let's just read quickly a little bit about this project. So the mission statement, the Catches Network is driven by a mission to revolutionize supply chain transparency through innovation, integration of cutting edge technology. The Caches protocol. Our goal is to empower users with wealth of detailed insights, fostering an environment of informed decision-making and trust within the marketplace. So have you guys ever heard of like VeChain, they sponsor the UFC? Sounds similar to that. I haven't read the white paper yet, but I'm just here to share with you guys about the airdrop news. I'll dive deeper into this project, but they're doing uh, stuff within the supply chains, it appears. Um, the use cases, let's read that. The versatility of Catches Network is evident in its diverse range of use cases for wholesale buyers. The platform offers robust application that allows for meticulous scrutiny and verification of product quality. Simultaneously produces leverage. This platform transparently showcases the superiority of their offerings, building trust with potential buyers. Um, Yeah, so the Catches Network is commitment to being fundamentally commodity driven, employing decentralized technologies to elevate supply chain transparency. There it is. So it's like the Quarium version of, of V Chain. We're going to be getting that airdrop. The date has not been announced yet. So that's two airdrops. This thing is like a money tree, Quarium. And uh, I love it. I love it. So, everybody, uh, Thank you for tuning into my channel. Remember, we're having a huge celebration in Los Angeles, February 24th, 2024. To keep it easy, 224-24. If you got me on Twitter, send me a DM. I'll send you the RSVP link. I would love to see you there to celebrate Zen Lounge uh, Validator. Everyone that's, uh, everyone that's taken to the Zen Lounge Validator is invited. You'll get free drinks. You'll be able to meet and engage with your favorite projects. And we're going to have an awesome night. So I would love to see you there. This is how I'm going to give back. I'm also planning to distribute some of the Quarium rewards to some type of Christmas charity. 
So Zen Laos will be powering a family's Christmas this holiday season. So, you know, with success, we also want to remember to give back. And uh, anyways, it's been an awesome time to be a part of uh, the Quarium community. We're seeing, you know, awesome stuff happening. And the rumor also that Bob posted is, and he also talked about in his podcast today, is that there's going to be some juicy exchange listings coming for both Sologenic and Corium. The party is just getting started. You know, by January 20, what, 24th, we'll have our first airdrop distributed of Sarah tokens. And I believe the decks will be live. There'll be all types of new functionalities of Corium. So, you know, it's really cool to be a part of something from the very beginning and to watch it bloom. It's almost like, you know, we've been watering these plants and now we're finally seeing it bloom and come to life. And uh, we started with Quorum IOU tokens that were like seeds. Now those seeds are blooming and booming. And soon these se seeds, the, the, this is going to turn into a giant tree and we're going to be, we're going to be cozy under the shade for the rest of our life. I really hope this project works out and it has a long term future. And um, I can just keep staking, stake it till I make it. That's my plan. Stake it till I make it. All right, everybody. Have an awesome, awesome day. And I'll see you guys tomorrow for some more videos. I almost forgot. You guys wanted me to cover the Corium Rich List. So let's cover the Corium Rich List. I'm going to start with... Uh, the top so we're on page one right now this is only corium main net so this is only the corium main net the number 17th and 18th wallet are at 1.1 million so if you have 1.1 million you are in the top 20 for corium wallets if you have 500,000 or more corium on corium main net you are currently in the top 44 wallets on, on Corium. So that's something that, that's pretty impressive. If you have 250,000 Corium, you are in the top 100, actually the top 90 wallets. That's something to be proud of. You are a giant whale. Let's go to 100,000. So if you have 100,000 Corium, you are in the top 247 wallets on the Corium blockchain. That is very, very impressive. You're definitely a whale with 100,000 Corium. Imagine if this thing moves like Solana and you have 100,000 of these things. Uh, if you have 50,000 Corium, if you have 50,000 Corium, you are in the top 475 wallets. Top 500 in the world. If you have 20,000 or more Corium, you are currently in the top 1,000 wallets. So There's 992 wallets plus that has 20,000 Corium. So, and we know the rest. We know that if you have 10,000 Corium, you are in the elite category of being in the top 1,500 in the entire world. Wow. We can look up some more stats while we're just hanging out, chilling. Another impressive stat from Corium Basically, 50% of the network has staked their tokens. 50% of the supply has staked. That's a lot. There is not that much Corium liquid. Uh, what else? Let's see how many wallets, active addresses. So there's right now 5,626 wallets that are active on Corium. So there's less than 10,000 wallets on Corium e ecosystem. I believe probably by January 19th, before the snapshot, I see a lot of more Cosmos influencers with a lot of followers starting to talk about Corium. 
I think that we could see 10,000 wallets just double by January 19th. Remember, this is just speculative thoughts. So there's 5,600 wallets. on the Corian blockchain. This is not including the XRPL data. So you can see the total stake is increasing. And remember I told you guys, early bird gets the worm as more people stake their tokens, more people bond their tokens. The staking APR will go down. Who remembers back the Core Nova days when the percentage was as high as like 50%? When Corium just launched, it was like 50%. Now it's down to 27%. And as the network grows, as more people stake, it's going to go down. So the opportunity to get the most rewards are now. And it will only decrease as more people join the network. So that's what I have for you guys today. Um, I believe out of those 5,600 wallets, only 3,600 are delegating, it looks like. Not sure if that's accurate. Anyways, I'll leave these analytics in the description below. You could browse through this, have fun, and uh, everybody have an awesome day.